a wetland. Kaduela, a small village in the suburbs of Colombo, Sri Lanka, is where my family has lived for a few generations now. The historical city, cited in many folklore, is a significantly large wetland. Hi, I am Mumdi Gatidira and I want to show you the challenges faced by my beautiful hometown. A wetland is a land which has many swamps and marshes. It is generally wet. It has lots of water bodies. Because of these features, it has a delicate unique ecosystem. Marshes and swamps with their green unique ecosystems is a sight to see in the mornings. This wetland has helped the village to keep away the floods in the heavy monsoons like this. Wetlands serve to store water, preventing floods, purify water, maintain biodiversity, preserve groundwater. These lands, which fulfilled their duties for centuries, have been challenged over the last three decades by unplanned actions of us, unplanned constructions, cutting down trees, contamination with chemicals and toxic products, plastic pollution and clogging, a compromising for wetlands. Whatever we do to the nature returns back harder. Disappearing wetlands result in flooding, loss of biodiversity, unsafe drinking water, loss of oxygen production. My hometown had been badly affected by floods during the past few years, destroying property and lives. Swamps which absorb rainwater has become so small that even a light rain would result in floods. It has become an urgent matter to find a solution to the floods. So what I have worked out my plan is 1. Conservation by law 2. Their plant constructions 3. Sustainable usage 4. Community-based cleaning projects 5. School-level awareness programs Conservation by law I suggest to identify significant wetlands in my area and to conserve them by law. Wetland constructions. I suggest any further construction done in the area should be well planned with the proper permission from authorities. This must have further damage. Sustainable usage. Usage of existing wetlands should be well planned and sustainable. Authorities should make necessary laws and most importantly, the community should support. Community-based cleaning projects. The most important stakeholder in this is the local community. So I suggest to initiate community-based cleaning programs to keep your own wetlands alive. School level awareness programs. Education begins from school. Involving local school kids in conservation of their own wetlands is another plan I came up with. This will take the message home too. Variety of awareness programs and active involvement in keeping wetlands safe can be initiated at school level. We are part of the nature. We cannot be separated from it. Whatever we do to the nation returns back hard. So it is time for us to act more responsible.